Good morning, guys. Today we're out at Puffing Billy. Hi, Somewhere, <laughs> we, yeah, we both haven't been since a kid. Like, I've not been here in ages. Barely remember it, to be honest. <laughs> I lost a flag out the window when I was a kid, so <laughs> maybe we'll see that there somewhere. Um, but yeah, very excited because it's all actually just been done up pretty recently, I think, like the information center, um, visitor center at Lakeside Station. Looks completely different. Brand new, so very, nice. very excited to see all that. Um, we've got a yoga class booked, so we're gonna go do some yoga. We haven't done it before. <laughs> well, like we've done little bits and pieces at home, but never like an actual class. So we're <laughs> a little bit nervous, but we should be fine. I'm sure it'll be very chill and just like relaxing. So it's gonna be a good way to start the morning and then get some brekkie as well. How'd you go with yoga? Not good. <laughs> <laughs> you did. We did well. Yoga's hardcore. Yeah. Never thought yoga would be that hard, but I tell you what, when makes you feel unfit. <laughs> yeah, when you haven't done it before and you're not like flexible and like used to it, it actually is like hard. But it was really good. Like I, the instructor was really good. She was like, take it at your own pace, like do this if you can't quite do that and like just really chill. Um, I really enjoyed it. We did pretty well. I did pretty well for my very first. Yeah, 100%. So. And very like relaxing and we feel very zen and like... I don't know, in a good mood and set for the day, so... Full of food. Yeah, so. and brekkie was really nice. Um, the food at the restaurant or cafe there was really good. So, so if you're looking at the yoga, the package is the way to go, I reckon. Yeah, because it's like $35 for brekkie, a hot drink, and the yoga. And or an Pilates, hour yoga anyway. or Pilates yeah. session. Yeah. So, so by the time you buy brekkie, there's 30 bucks anyway. Literally. So. <laughs> Such a good package. Um, so we thoroughly enjoyed that and it was really nice to see the visitor center like quiet as well because obviously mm. not many people are there because the trains aren't quite running yet. Um, so we had a look in the museum as well which was really good. So had one of the old steam trains there which was cool. So now we're in the car. We are driving to Belgrave. That's it. We're driving to Belgrave um, station for Puffing Billy. To catch the train back here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll explain later but um, yeah that's where our Puffing Billy train ride starts so let's go. Alright, so we made it out to Belgrave. It's so gold. <laughs> it Hence is the quite beanies fresh. <laughs> yeah, and the extra jackets. Um, but that's okay, we came prepared. <laughs> um, so we're just basically waiting for our train. It leaves at 12.30, which heads back to Lakeside, which is where we were to do the yoga yes. and where the big information center was. Yeah. Yep. So, kind of a bit of backtracking, but this is the only line between here and Lakeside. We can actually sit on the window sills, yeah, I guess you call it. And yeah. have your legs hanging out with, and arms and everything. Yeah. With the open carriages on the train, so that's the reason that we're doing this one. So that's super exciting. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Um, yeah. It's about an hour train trip. And then once we get back to Lakeside, we have some e-bikes, some electric bikes um, hired, booked. First time, ready yeah. to go. <laughs> we've never done it before, so we're pretty excited. Time to be lazy. Yeah, yeah. just sit on the bike and tell it where to go. <laughs> Don't have to pedal, so that'll be nice. Yeah. Um, and we're going to pick up a picnic pack for lunch. So we'll go pick that up, take the bikes and go find somewhere nice to have a little picnic find somewhere for lunch. Cool. Yeah. Yeah. And enjoy the hour train ride there. Yeah. And then we are, what is it, the last train coming back. So we can't miss the return train, yeah. which is <laughs> three o'clock. So The guy said otherwise it's a long walk. So we'll make sure we don't <laughs> we'll do that. We'll just steal the e-bike and yeah. come up. But we're super excited to show you. It's going to be really cool. Awesome. So check in before the train closes half an hour before the train actually arrives. So we arrived an hour early just in case. There's not a whole heap to do here, but there's a little shop with a cafe um, and like a souvenir shop. And there's some cool places to just look around and get photos, but all in all, not that much to do. And it's just started raining, <laughs> but that's okay. We'll be inside soon. So we've got our seats on the carriage and then this is where you can sit on the windowsill and hold on here. So Matt's decided he's going to spend the whole trip one hour straight <laughs> sitting up here. <laughs> 59 minutes to go. <laughs> Hope it's comfy.
Yeah, so we're currently at Menzies Creek, and this is where the trains often cross um, because it's a platform in between. So I think now we're waiting for a train to come the opposite way. So in here is where they change the tracks. So they've turned our tracks to keep us here for now, and they're letting the other one through. What have we got, Matt? Oh. So many goodies. Rolls, yeah, fruit salad. Actual salad. Actual salad. And sweets. Oh, yes. And my dessert. And a oh, yogurt. Yum. That is beautiful. Here's a uh, delicious food, and it's so good, you just pre order it. And then when we went to the visitor center, it was just ready at the front entrance. So good. There's our cute little bikes, and we have a little visitor here. Ah, go away. Right, so we've got our e-bikes and they actually seriously go like I can't believe how much they take off. I want one. All right, do a demo, Matt. All right, so up the hill we go. Bye. <laughs> you got to really tell on camera, but seriously, they go so quick. It's kind of scary. This is how you control it. Basically, the green is like the battery. And then when you turn this up, the red dots are the power of basically help with the motor. <laughs> also, how pretty are these bikes? She says they're only new, like a couple of months old. And they're so nice. You can't even tell they're electric. Like there's nothing, there's no box motor or anything on them. So cool. So these are by Cog Bikes. And they're just at the Lakeside Visitor Information Center, basically out the front. And there's so many different ones you can hire. It's such a good idea. Oh my God. That's so, <laughs> That's so quick. So this is the trail we're just on, the Eastern Dandenong Rangers Trail. It's so pretty with all the ferns and stuff through there. And this is literally just right opposite the lakeside station so it's perfect to take the bikes. <laughs> 